Good morning and welcome to our morning devotion insight. This morning, I would like to share with you out of weakness, strength. Uh, and the uh, scripture is found in Hebrews chapter 11, verse 34. In the KJV version, it says, Out of weakness, we're made strong. You know, um, there is a saying that at the, you know, strong at the broken places. Strong at the broken places. You know, sometimes in life, uh, how can we be made strong? You know, how can we say that uh, we feel uh, more stronger? is when we are at the broken places. You know, um, Ernest Hemingway said this, Life breaks us all, but many are made strong at the broken places. So this morning, or maybe this season, if your life is going through a place of brokenness, maybe this is the time that out of weakness, there will be strength. You know, um, the gentle Holy Spirit allows us or nudges us that when we allow God to help us in our weakness, then the place where we are weak can be the place that we are made strong. It is a principle of life that the place in which a bone breaks and then heals will be so strong that generally speaking, it will never break there again. So even in the natural, you know, when the skin is cut and scar tissue forms, the healed part becomes tougher than the surrounding skin. If this happens so much in the natural, why not or much more in the spiritual? You know, the author or the writer of Hebrews tells us in this passage that God is an expert at taking the weaknesses of his children and turning them into strength. Praise God, isn't it? Thank God, really. That our brokenness are not wasted because God takes our brokenness, you know, the pieces and allow us and helps us to be strong. What an encouraging truth that when we are broken through circumstances, through the situations in life that we can be made strong. So here it tells us that uh, when we are made strong, there are, have you ever been broken by life to such an extent that you feel an overwhelming sense of weakness? You know, I'm sure all of us have. I have. You know, there are times that we, we feel so broken, so um, difficult to go through. You know, God, uh, another time, another day, another moment, Lord, help me. Can I go through it? Then take heart because we have also seen that God specializes in matching his ability to your disability. Amen. So when we really feel we can't, when we really feel that we are weak, then indeed, God makes that weakness into our strength. So by His transforming grace, your frustration can become fruitful. Huh? So by His grace, He transforms us, He helps us, and by because of His transforming grace, that we can become fruitful. Fruitful in what? Fruitful in strength. Fruitful to be able to move on. Fruitful to be a victor. So you can be strong. Or you and I can be strong at the broken places. So this morning, let our prayer be, Oh Father, this sounds like a fine theory, but it can really become a fact. Why? Because your word says it can. I just saw we read it, out of weakness, we were made strong. I can be ready and eager to learn, Lord. Teach me, my Father, to be able to say, I can be strong in broken places. Amen. In Jesus' name. May you find strength in the Lord in whatever broken places that you are experiencing. Amen. God bless you.